how's the game so far for you? Uh, to be honest, the first one I came out with like kind of a nosebleed. I I came out absolutely swinging, and I shocked myself to be honest how how, uh, how good the first round went. But then after that, I kind of settled down and uh, getting there. I'm enjoying it. I mean, it's, it's difficult out there, but it was always going to be. But uh, yeah, we're not quite. I mean, the TQ and the win's not in the bag yet, but. You know, by the end of the week, I'm hoping I, if I make the final again, I'll be pretty pleased with that. That should be that, that'll be a pretty good effort. No, I, I feel very confident out there on the track. Uh, it's it's definitely showing some tech character right now. Uh, it started to get bumpy, but compared to the warm up, we have a lot more grip this time. So uh, you have to set up the car a little bit differently. Uh, I'm trying a diff few different tires uh, today, and I didn't change two. I, I mean, like two small changes on my car, but mainly I've been working on the tires, uh, tire setup, and which compound and thread pattern to go with. So, uh, for the last one, I'm gonna make a fourth uh, different tire to try, and and, and uh, we'll see how it goes. But yeah, car is working great, and and even every. I mean, the whole package is great. It's just a matter of and finding your your uh, yeah whatever you like on the car and etc. So, uh, it should be good for tomorrow. And what's going on with the weather? It's like we're in Spain with this sunshine. It's like 26, 27 degrees. What's going on? Yeah, it's pretty hot today, but uh, I guess we'll have some showers coming in here in the later on the week. So uh, for now, it's, it's, it's good and uh, everybody seems to like it. So hopefully it continues like this. Crossing our fingers. But you got your rain stuff prepared, maybe? Yeah, I have it. Yeah, I think it's pretty good. It seemed quite up there. Obviously, it's still the free lap stuff, which never, nev none of us ever really agree with, especially on like a such a big track and stuff. Uh, thoughts are that I'm changing changing some shock stuff, changing the tyre just for the last one, see how it goes. And looking forward to the speedway tonight. Um, what do you think of the track so far? Do you think it's going to hold up? I think it might. I think it might. I was out there marshalling the last time thinking it hadn't really changed much. There is some bits, but it doesn't... It's, it seems like some of the whatever they used to put on top kind of was at different kind of levels in the like some might have soaked in in places but maybe how it was applied wasn't 100% all the way around so some places have got like a bit broken but then stopped and other places like the, the point where I marshal up the top left uh, hairpin by number four if you sweep like all of the outside bit it's like it's like a tarmac road like it's completely solid so Hopefully it won't get too bad. I don't mind it getting bumpy, but the warm-up was a little bit over the top. So hopefully it doesn't degrade too much from from now. Um, really happy that the track's going to get bumpy. Is it? I think so. Yeah. Maybe I don't know. Probably about the same as the warm-up. Maybe a bit different kind of bumps because of the dust text, but it's still going to get rough. I think, which is nice. We have to drive unconventional lines to be smooth and fast. So I enjoy that. You mean it helps you? It helps me because I'm all over the place normally, so now being all over the place is actually good. So before you're on the wrong line, now you're on the right line. Exactly. My line becomes the racing line. It's good. I like it. So how is it going for Max so for your, your protege? Well, I've got two Maxes now. Full throttle Max and, uh, and the Finnish Max. And they're both doing well, actually. Uh, actually, I think all the JQ drivers are doing pretty well at the moment. Black Edition seems to be liking the Swedish summer. Good marketing there. Yeah, yeah, I know. Um, no secret, really. Um, obviously, we didn't have a transponder in the first two runs, so no one really could see what we was doing. But it was just that we was running a different car. Um, now we've got a newer car out. It's got the transponder in, so um, I guess the lap times are showing now. Um, we knew we had the pace earlier on. The car's pretty easy to drive, which I'm really happy about. It's quite important on this track. Now it's starting to get bumpy. The track's... Uh, blowing out in sections so it's gonna every round's really changing a lot uh, when you get the track so you kind of like is it the setup or is it track but when you speak to a few other drivers in your heat you understand that it's the track do you think i mean can you see it deteriorating like the warm-up or I, I mean i guess with the dust x it's completely different to how it was uh, back in may um i think the track's going to be the same if not worse um we've got more days now i mean this is just the first day more drivers um I mean, yeah, the binding agent they've put on there is kind of just peeling off anyway. Um, we walked it yesterday and you could literally peel it off like a piece of plastic. Um, it's Most of it's gone now. There's a few sections that are still uh, on the track, but they're coming out in big chunks. So I think it will 
it won't be there by the finals. But you're looking forward to the bumps. Yeah, you know, it's, it's never that fun to drive in bumps, but we did well last time, so I hope it goes the same again. Uh, finally, the track is not super similar as a warmer, but it's getting bumpy. So I think for tomorrow or maybe Thursday it will be super, super bumpy. <laughs> At least we tried so many different setups during the three hits. I think we found a quite good base to work with. So on the last one, we will test another thing. And I think it will be almost the setup for the whole week. So at least we are happy because the, the car is getting good and comfortable that here it's the main, the main problem to get a, a car really comfortable with that bumps. It's not super fast. I'm maybe a little bit slower than Boots, for example, in the last kit that he made 39s, but at least I could make some 40s all the time, so we're happy about it.